Hi, Virgo. <clears throat> Virgo. Virgo. All right, so you have the Ace of Pentacles. Okay, you have the Ace of Pentacles coming towards you. All right, um, but I feel like there's someone that's trying to stop this Ace of pentacles from coming towards you <clears throat> the ace of pentacles okay that's a new beginning that could also be a new life okay um a pregnancy whether it's a physical pregnancy, a spiritual pregnancy, okay. You have support, okay. So you do have support. Or you could be supporting someone or someone wants your support. You have releasing. So you're releasing support. Maybe you are helping someone. <clears throat> you're no longer helping this person. Okay. Maybe I feel like someone was taking your kindness for weakness. They were taking advantage of your generosity. Yeah, someone was definitely taking advantage of your generosity. You have the past, okay? So someone in your past. And then you have meant to be in reverse. So something is not meant to be. I feel like someone is in love with you. They want a relationship with you. But you don't feel the same way. This could be a water sign. Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. Okay. <clears throat> yeah and then you have support again so i feel like someone wants your support i feel like you're no longer going to help someone or something like that let's see virgo Yeah, you have the King of Pentacles. So your finances, they look great, okay? Um, something about the King of Pentacles here. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. What is this? Yeah, king of swords, like I said. It's like you're cutting someone off financially. I just feel like, you know, this is pretty simple. 
pretty straightforward. You're no longer going to help someone. Yeah, seven of pentacles, nine of pentacles. Someone needs to support themselves. They need to help themselves. It's like they're looking at you like you're their meal ticket or you're their way out of something, but you're not. I mean, I feel like you were helping this person, but this person started to take advantage of you, okay? And it's like you picked up on that. Could definitely be an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Or your father could be an air sign. A Libra. And I feel like he's warning you about someone. He's warning you that someone in your life could simply just be using you or they're around for the wrong reasons. Okay. It could be a Cancer. King of Swords. Three of Swords. And then you have this Ace of Pentacles. Yeah. It's like someone is trying to... Yeah, Virgo. Someone is trying to latch themselves onto you they're holding on to you because of this ace of pentacles okay but yeah you're going to cut this person off or you've already cut this person off. You let this person go. Yeah, you have deception and envy. Yeah, they're jealous of your spiritual strength. Okay. They're also jealous of your heart. Like, they're jealous that you're not a hateful person. You're not a, um, a mean person. You're still loving. Something about the color green. I'm seeing a lot of green, so a lot of money. All right, what else is here? All right, you have sacrifice and solitude, okay? With suffering in silence. Someone is also <clears throat> suffering. Or they feel like they're suffering because they could not sacrifice you in some way. Okay, or you just decided to cut this person off. And I feel like this is not necessarily just you know, financial support. I feel like this is emotional support, okay? Not only were you supporting this person um, financially, you were helping them emotionally, okay? This kind of reminds me of this story. I don't remember her name, but she was very, very wealthy. I don't know if this was in China or Japan, but it was this this um, entrepreneur or someone who was this woman who was well off. It was either in China or Japan. I can't remember. But she helped her family. She helped, you know, everyone, her immediate family, her in-laws, pretty much everyone. And then when she decided to cut this person off or when she decided to go separate ways, they ended up killing her. I'm not saying that, you know, this is a type of situation, but I'm kind of picking up on that kind of energy where there's like animosity towards you. There's, you know, dislike, maybe gossip, plotting, planning against you. 
all because you decided to cut this person off. And I feel like this person could be older than you. This person could be older than you, but you're helping them out. Yeah, and they ended up they ended up murdering her. I forgot the I forgot her name. But when she decided to cut them off, they killed her. They dismembered her. They dismembered her body. Okay. I'm not saying that that's exactly what this is. But it kind of reminds me of the same situation. But they're not going to do anything to you. They're not going to harm you. They're just mad. And that's not really your problem. Okay. I feel like you've helped enough. Okay, yeah, positive movement forward. You're moving forward. Prosperity and obstacles and challenges. They may try to stop you from moving on. They may try to guilt trip you. But I feel like they were holding you back. Okay. What is obstacles and challenges? Yeah, fulfillment of wishes. You may have a hard time saying no, or you may have a hard time cutting them off. But I feel like once you do this, once you decide to move forward, then more of your wishes will come true. Okay? So someone is a blessing blocker. Yeah, they're trying to block your blessings, or they're trying to block what's to come. Heartache and loss. They're hurting because you're getting what you want. This could be the lifestyle that you live. <clears throat> Something about your lifestyle. The way that you live. They're jealous of that. <clears throat> you have moving on in reverse. Yeah, and they're not moving on from that. They're holding on to you. But I feel like you let them down easy. Or you will let them down easy. But emotionally, they're very disrupted. Okay? Yeah, movement, choices, and decisions in reverse. Yeah, they made bad choices. They made bad choices. And it's like they're looking at you to solve it or to clean up their mess, but you're not a maid. Okay. You're not their room service or anything like that. You're not their nanny, you're not their maid, you're not their babysitter, you're not their parent. Now, this could be a situation where you have to decide, you're going to decide to stop financially supporting your child. <clears throat> your child could be grown. Okay. And then you have choose wisely.
they also need to be cautious or they need to be careful of what they say to you or what they say about you. Okay, they could be slandering your name, gossiping. Okay. So basically, Virgo, you're leveling up. Okay, they're jealous. They should be happy for you, not jealous. And they should be grateful or thankful that you helped them. Because you didn't have to. Okay. Yeah, you have ascending, floating to the top. Yeah, you're leveling up. Okay. So I'm seeing balloons. It could be someone's birthday. You could be throwing a birthday party for someone. Or you're going to get an invitation to a party. This is like a um, celebrity or someone who is well known. Yeah, miracle. Gracious gifts from spirit. You're being rewarded. Simply because you deserve it. Okay. And then you have to expand your reach. Branch out. Some of you could be starting a business. Or you already have a business. But you're taking your business to other cities, other states. This could be like a vending machine business. Yeah, or a vending machine. Okay. I also see someone purchasing a building for work. Like an office or something. You have wish granted. Your dreams are coming true. Yeah, and someone is upset about that. I'm getting it's more than one person. More than one person that's upset about this. I just feel like they're focused on the on the wrong thing. Like if they focus on bettering themselves, if they focus on themselves, their life, their situations, then they can achieve the same thing. Maybe not in the same way. Because they're not you. I'm kind of picking up this energy of I want to be like Virgo when I grow up. Yeah, someone wants to be like you. Okay. They want to be successful like you. But it's like they're refusing to do the work. Okay. You have connected High vibe tribe. Yeah, getting ahead, collaboration, and winning. Okay. Yeah, so you could definitely be collaborating with other people. You have sideways and direct path to success. They also want to know how do you do something? How is it that you're successful? But I feel like you can't give this person or you can't give this group your recipe. And even if they try to fix this up, you know, it's not going to be the same way. It's not going to taste the same.
Yeah, pyramid. Powerful people. You're becoming a very powerful person, Virgo. But I'm getting it's your birthright. Okay. This is your fate. All right, Virgo. So that's all for this message.